Kevin, uh, two 0 win up here in Beacon. Your thoughts on today's game? Um, just delighted to get away with three points. It was a really tough game. You know, one that I felt we deserved in the end, but it was a, a tough journey from the, the first minute to the ninetieth. Uh, took our time to get a hold. You know, to get, get to grips with the conditions and how well that Beacon were playing. So, um, but it was really competitive. You know, up until that half time point, with a few chances right before half time, but. Um, but the boys have stuck to it, they've stuck to task and, and we've got the rewards. Do you think the pitch played a big part today? Um, I, I mean, I, I played a part for both teams, I think it affected the football match as a whole, but I mean, the pitch held up fantastically well. Uh, certainly didn't play a part in any of the goals or, you know, any big moments in the game, but, you know, it was, as I say, it was, I thought we played really well, especially when we got the goal up, it, you know, we were in real control and showed a, a real maturity in our play today, so delighted with that. Dylan Bakey back on the score sheet once again. Hi, um, you know the, what you've got to give credit there. You know Max Wright wins the ball in the middle of the park. It's a fantastic assist. You know, and with that desire and what great um, the chance doesn't come about. For then on in, you know it's all about the class and the finish. Um, great ball, great way to pass, great composure for Dylan. You know, in the, the left channel, and as I say, he tucks it away in the corner of the net, and you know we're one up. And, but I delighted for him, you know, momentum's everything in football right now, we're, we're hitting a wee bit of momentum, so hopefully we can continue that. There wasn't a lot for Nicky Hogarth to do today, but what he did do, uh, he did quite well, wouldn't you say so? Aye, he came in the first half and took a bit of a knock, you know, uh, boy caught him late, but it was brave, he came and punched the ball away. Um, he took a couple of great crosses in the second half to alleviate the pressure that we were under at times. Um, so I know, listen, Nicky's contribution has been fantastic since he came. Um, I've, Said all along about his maturity, and he's shown, you know, beyond his years that head, and he's he's got on his shoulders. So he needs to keep doing that, but also needs to keep challenging himself to get better and better and better. But um, you know, he's the right type, Nicky. He wants to get better and he wants to learn. So hopefully, we're giving him that environment. Do you think Kevin made an impact, Kevin Nichol coming on uh, during the second ah, half? Ke Kevin brings a, you know, I think he brings an, an assurance to the whole team when he's on the part. You know, he's. We all know what Kevin's good at, you know, he's also got ability that we don't talk about. <laughs> Everybody thinks he's just, you know, tackles and headers. He's not, he's got ability, but when he's on that park, you can just tell the players beside them, you know, they feel more confident with Kevin there in terms of when they're in the trenches, they know that he's going to be the guy digging them out of it, you know, or, or certainly helping out. So, um, as I say, it was just a wee tactical shift to see the game out, um, the second goal. You know, a bit of a collector's item for James Craney, uh, particularly with his right foot. Um, but delighted for him because he's came back to the club, you know, after a, a first spell. Uh, and he's he's just been fantastic for this football club this season. And uh, he was outstanding on the day and he got his rewards with a great goal. Uh, Stenish, we're on Tuesday night. How do you go into that game? We go into it full of confidence, you know, we go into it with every chance of winning it, as of Steny. So, you know, we've got to approach it, take our confidence, be aggressive and on the front foot, uh, be brave, taking the ball in tight areas and, and playing the way we can. Um, but it's going to be a colossal battle, I would say, you know, conditions, derby match, Steny are on a good run, you know, they've picked up certainly and they'll be driving for the rest of the season, driving forward as will we hopefully. Um, so I've got absolutely no doubts how difficult this is going to be. So we're preparing for it already. Thanks very much, Kevin. Thanks, Ben.